my backpack on, I'm gone if I'm chatting to your girl. What up guys, we're back with another video. We've got the Varsity jacket dropping this week. It's the first ever outerwear piece for the collection. So I thought I'd do a little bit of a launch week vlog for you guys. We're gonna head to the warehouse just to go over the product quality. We'll also show the team there how we want to pack. Also, I gotta drop the lanyards off as well. And then after that, we're just gonna prep the website, have all the images ready, have the size charts ready, and then do a little bit more admin work too. Do some social media stuff. And usually on launch weeks, we'll have like a shoot, but we did that last week. So we'll add a few clips in from that in the video now. Little fit check. Um, we got Jordan 4, Pure Money's. Jeans are from some brand from Korea. They're like a super wide leg fit. Sweats lanyard for the keys. Varsity jacket. Charlotte Mercy for the sunnies. And New Era beanie. We're just gonna check over the Varsity jacket stock. I always like to compare the samples to the actual bulk order because sometimes there can be some variances. So we're just gonna do a quality check on that. We're also gonna grab one of each size, small up to 3XL. And then we personally like to try them on like the whole size run on. So then we can give the best kind of sizing guidelines to you guys. So if you send your height and your weight, we can then kind of compare off how it fits us and then give you the best advice. Looks good. So it's actually got chain stitched patches um, and then just like a regular embroidery here. If you look like really closely, you can see like the chain stitching along here. The body is constructed of a heavyweight French terry. So it has kind of like a really good luxe feel, but then it's also lined with kind of like a silk lining. Feels a little bit more cozy on the body. Pop button closure for the hardware. And then again, like a patch logo on the front here and some embroidery. We got free lanyards with the first hundred orders. It's like a little key accessory for your keys. Um, so you can like hang it out of your pocket like this, or you can just throw it out, it's up to you. Not sure if you'd want to walk around wearing it like this. No, that's fire. <laughs> that's fire? <laughs> These have literally been like a year, a year and a half in the making. I designed them at the start of last year, but took a few rounds of sampling. Production took quite a long time just because it's like a little bit more of an intricate piece. And then by that time, I'd kind of missed the winter period last year. So I kind of put them to the side and held off until this year to reintroduce them. In terms of like the timeline of the drops and everything, it just fitted into this year a lot better because we're gonna be incorporating a lot more statement pieces, a lot more outerwear stuff and kind of expanding the brand's collection. I don't know about you. Crazy. But I feel different. You feel different? I feel different. Do you reckon you'd be the XL? Yeah. Oh, you know what? But even where? Double XL. Double XL, right? Yeah. These run a bit true to size, so I always recommend sizing up. I can't really see how it looks. Like, it looks normal, but if you wanted to fit a hoodie under it, I'd probably go probably double XL. one size yeah. up. Oh, double XL there? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That yeah, double XL's double XL. way better. Yeah, no, double XL. So how tall are you? How tall am I? Six one. Not six foot. Six one. Six one. And I'm proud to be. You had to, to let him know. I'm proud to be. <laughs> um, and then what's your weight? My weight, I'd say probably around 82, 80. 80, 82? I've been yeah, bulking sweet. up, 82, 82, 83. 61, 80 kilos is this man's dimensions. For sizing reference, I'm six foot six and 120 kilos. <laughs> nah, I'm wearing an XL and I'm 180 centimeters and 75 kilos. I went for the XL just so it's a more relaxed kind of oversized fit with a bit more room through the arms and the body. If you like it a little bit more fitted, I'd probably just go your usual sizing. But yeah, I went with the, with the XL. 
<laughs> we're gonna head to a cafe and just do some back-end stuff I need to set up the product in the store change the store around a little bit to match the launch and then we're gonna spend a bit of time on socials just replying to DMs doing the questions box stuff and then that's that's basically it we're pretty much good to go we've been um, super proactive on this one so hyped to finally have this thing dropped it's a good day for a great day and that's all I will say What is it you're doing? Hold your finger down on the photo and then move it around to see where it suits best. Sometimes I'm like stuck for like days because I have OCD with how the feed looks. Or sometimes it just flows perfectly. Do you reckon it's best to launch with a reel or a photo? I think reels get more exposure. Yeah. Let's see what videos you got. Photo is so good. I can't believe that's just on black and white film. Just got back home. I'm gonna do the last finishing touches on the website. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit of what goes on behind the scenes on a launch week. Just remember, Thursday, 6 p.m. AST. Varsity jacket goes live. Appreciate the love and support always. Put my backpack on, I'm gone. If I'm chatting to your girl, swear it's long. I'm the definition of fun.